two opposites. You know, it's like the craziness and the beauty and the South Beach, the way it goes, and then the sunsets of the Everglades. I think it's so Miami because, uh, I don't know, it's just unique. You don't see that everywhere. It's really like a melting pot of people. Miami is this combination of sights, sounds, cultures, and there's many things that we feel make us quite interesting. Some of them are quite, kind of bold, kind of quirky, but we feel that is what makes Miami an interesting place and is the essence of the It's So Miami campaign. What makes the Miami Beach sunbathing scene so Miami is, of course, we have an amazingly beautiful couple, but they're also having what is considered one of the most humblest drinks in the world. It's an ice cold coconut. It's influenced by our tropical nature and of course our, our Latin nature. That truly is a quintessential So Miami moment. What's So Miami about this shoot? It's like, it kind of epitomizes the glamour. This is what we, in England, we see on TV. Because there aren't too many places in the world where you can actually be on a bike, which is part of a bike share program, be in a business suit and be commuting back and forth to your place of employment, whether it's a hotel, whether it's a restaurant. But what makes it so Miami is that this is Ocean Drive and there's only one Ocean Drive that exists in the world. It's the epicenter of the excitement that makes Miami so, so incredibly interesting for many, many places. And of course, steps away from the world famous Ocean Drive Beach. Not many places in the world can you actually pull up on a side street and get Cuban cortaditos and espressos at a moment's notice. But in addition to that, you'll have people, whether they're in t-shirts or in Brooks Brothers suits, pulling up in bicycles or in fancy cars, sharing counter space and indulging one of the quintessential Miami experience. And of course, it adds a little jolt to your body, to your life, and it, and it energizes you to fully experience what Miami has to offer. It's a party on the beach in the winter. And it happens to be an event that attracts a lot of our gay and lesbian customers, which are critically important to the success of our industry. We recognize this, we embrace this. It's part of our diversity, part of our culture, and it's something that we feel is so Miami. You can come to Miami and take in an amazing underwater reef experience, but do it in a very, very unique way. Here you have the sea trick. You don't have to strap on the heavy tanks. Um, you know, you have aquariums everywhere in the world, and you look through a little glass and wonder what it's like to be in there with the fish, but this is one of the few places you get to get in and really be a part of that, and they're at an arm's length uh, swimming around with you. So that's very Miami, and you can do it in a 300,000 gallon tank in the middle of a city, or you can go, you know, 10 feet out to the beach and dive in, and you get the same experience both places. 30 minutes from downtown, 35 minutes from South Beach, you can jump on this airboat and have the most thrilling experience through the Everglades, which is a uniquely South Florida, Miami experience. It's truly like riding a roller coaster on the water. And this combination of the river of grass is truly something that a lot of people don't associate with Miami, but we feel is the perfect combination of a tropical urban experience. Here we are in an industrial neighborhood which just years ago was derelict and it's been now converted into a cultural oasis with amazing colors, amazing artists. So, and this is just minutes from South Beach, it's just minutes from downtown Miami and it's a cultural experience that folks can come and hopefully enjoy firsthand and literally walk through the art. So this is truly a So Miami moment. celebrating our culture but in a very very unique way because where else in the world could you sit in a park stare at the side of a Frank Gehry designed building and take in a high-definition cultural performance what makes the downtown skyline scene so Miami of course is the combination of an amazing skyline that has developed over the last several years in downtown which is now a livable part of our community with great restaurants and residents and it's literally at the mouth of a working river. That, I think, sets us apart from other places. You know, our music and, and our culture and our accent and our food um, sets us apart from all the other beaches and all the other areas in, in the world.